Good afternoon, Tigers, and welcome to Tiger Vision News for Thursday, October 28th. I'm Weston, and this is my co-host, Avery. Thanks for joining us today. Now we have some late-breaking news. Hi, I'm Weston, and I'm here with Mr. Loafman. When is Red Wib Ribbon Week this year? Red Ribbon Week will be next week, October 24th through the 28th. Why do we take part in Reb Red Ribbon Week? So Red Ribbon Week is a national organization, and the big thing is is to promote drug-free environments, and it's just a promotion in schools, um, events that different schools do different things participation-wise that way. What kind of activities does the student council have planned planned for us during Red Ribbon Week? So one of the things is we're going to be having different dress up days um, just to promote that. Uh, we just want everybody to be, they just want everybody to be drug free and making good choices. Thank you. We'll be right back after these messages. Hi, my name is Chloe and I'm here with Calvin. Tell us about the golf tournament. How did it go? Uh, we did good. We've gotten third in both of the tournaments. What did you enjoy most about the tournament? Uh, just having fun, getting out of class early. How much practice do you put in before the tournament? Uh, we go to the facility pretty much every day and just hit, so a lot. What's next for the golf team? Uh, we have a next tournament next Tuesday. Thank you. Hi, I'm Jocelyn here with Emory. Why do you do golf? Um, because it's fun. What's your favorite thing about golf? Um, probably our coach. Who's your coach? Coach McDonald. Thank you. Wash your hands, wash your hands, everybody come along. Yeah. Wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands, everybody come along. Yeah. Wash your hands. Welcome back to the Tiger Vision News. The band's got some very special auditions coming up soon. They'll be auditioning for our region and are now getting ready to step up to the challenge. Practice hard, Tigers. Our twirlers and cheerleaders might also have a big event coming up. They'll help get to perform in our next pep rally. If we have one, it'll probably be in the auditorium again. It's going to be fun. I can't wait. Also plan on going to the next student council meeting. All members are required to be there. Now let's check in with Wes and see what's going on, our, on in our weather forecast. Hi, I'm Weston here. I'm here with the current conditions. Uh, sunny, 74 degrees, uh, 10 miles an hour, winds to the north, and zero chance of rain. Uh, today's national forecast, uh, cool uh, up in this area, and then it gets warmer down over here. Uh, Five-day forecast, uh, pretty nice temperatures the next few days with a cold front pushing through. Sunday. That's it for weather. Back to you. Now it's time to find out what's going on in sports. Hello sports fans. I'm Kingston. This is Clay. And here's a look at today's sports. Tonight the girls take on Laura Bush Middle School in volleyball. Our teams have shown a lot of improvement this season and are really ready for the challenge. Here's more. Hi, I'm Lily here with uh, Coach Phoenix. When does volleyball season end? Uh, volleyball season will end this week for our B teams, but it'll end next week for our A teams. When's your all's next volleyball game? Uh, we have a game against Laura Bush. Eighth grade will be playing here, and uh, seventh grade will travel over to Laura Bush. What's your favorite thing about coaching volleyball? Just watching the girls uh, grow as athletes and just become one as a team. Thank you. The games start at 5.30 and 6.30. Get out and support the girls. That's a look at today's sports. That's all we have for today. Everyone have a great afternoon. We'll see you later. Until then, Tigers. Bye.